And we're back with uh, stories making our e-news and reviews this week. Music distributor Happyloss's Johnny Wanda has listed Vibes Cartel as the best seller in dance hall despite being incarcerated. Dance hall, me everything. This, he says, is attributable not only to his immense popularity but also the large body of work he releases. Also on Johnny's list of top sellers, Spice, Popcorn, Dexter Daps and Alkaline. Some of you will remember that Dexter Daps was caught up in a brawl at the Sangsa International Airport in Montego Bay in April of this year and was slapped with charges for assault, indecent language, among others. Well, this week, on the advice of Daps's lawyer, Peter Champagny, the prosecution has decided to not pursue the matter any further, and all charges laid against the 7-Eleven singer has been dropped. Five years ago, Jamaicans fell in love with an affable character from the Magnum Kings and Queens of Dancehall show called Tanto Blacks. But like many of the other contestants from the show, after a while, the excitement fizzes out. But it now seems that this artiste slash slanger has a buzz once again. With slangs like Tanamane, Tanamana, Tanamane and Real Rich gaining traction on the streets and in social media. So what's my first name? Real! So what's my last name? Rich! So what's all my name? Real Rich! Could 2016 be the year of Tanto Blacks? Stay tuned to On Stage. The latest Jamaican artist to go to extremes for attention is a man who goes by the name Linguist, who created a scene in Halfway Tree two weeks ago, depicting the crucifixion of Jesus Christ, driving around Halfway Tree and calling himself the savior of dancehall. Well, the verdict is still out on that one, but in the meantime, the man who preceded him in that regard is the Towerman Icon, who was released this week from jail after serving a three-month sentence on assault charges. Singing Melody is the latest Jamaican artist to open up his private life to the public through the medium of reality TV. You will, will not believe what the guy did to the place. The first season of a reality series featuring the wanted back singer and his wife Ruby kicks off this weekend in Jamaica. Melody is our very special guest right now, right here on stage. Bless you, love, sir. How you been, man? Good to have you. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you. Reality star. I, st I start laughing already, you know, guys. <laughs> I'm just waiting on the questions them to become hitting at me right now, but... No, no, it's I'm ready, I'm ready, man. I'm it's ready. not allowed because of you. The first one is, why did you want to open up your private life to the public? Well, it's, it, you know, when I think about it now, yes. I, could, I could explain it a little bit more easier because before I couldn't see it, yeah. Um, because I've always been known to be this quiet and private person, mm -hmm. you know. My wife is like, you know, we got this idea since 2010. She's been on my back f to do it. Yeah. So I said to her, no, no, I'm, I'm not like that. I can't do that. And she's like, all right, we got to have a meeting and explain to you why I think it is good. Yes. So she came to me and we sat down and she said, well, you know, this being the kind of man you are and the husband that you have always been, I think it really would change a lot of people, young people's life if you, you try to open up a little bit more to let people learn a little bit more from you in terms of a person because she knows me inside and out. So when I think about the whole Heidi and everything, I said, you know, this may help a lot of people as well, you know. So I decided to put a foot in. Next thing I know, I have two foot in there. Next thing I know, hands and heads and everything is okay, in. That's interesting because help a lot of people would, on the face of it, suggest that it's all very inspirational, very and good. Your life, exactly, exactly. Isn't that your real life? That your, it's, yeah, your it's life definitely, is very it's, inspirational. It's, it is not and very good. Yes, but isn't it also <laughs> expected that some of the pitfalls, some of the issues, would well, also be be part of that? Well, you see, people, that, that's so the whole speak. thing. You know, it's it's a balance of life. You know, it's everything that packs into life. You know, and we're not talking about scripted thing. We're talking about real stuff. The way we behave, the way we operate around each other, the way we help each other, the way we build together. You know, and of course, you know, the home is a big part of it because we're building our dream home. And because of that, 
the show surrounded all of that to, to show, give people an idea, especially people who are just building or going into building a house. They can get ideas from that and how to, you know, stay away from certain things and how to actually, what to do in, in, when you're building a home and certain things like that. So it's opening up a different door in terms of our Jamaican diaspora. So we're seeing it all. Everything, Everything. is revealed. Everything is revealed. Everything. Yes. No secrets, nothing. Because over the years, like I said, you know, I tried to tread on a line where I could use my life as an example, you know, because I always think of that moment coming from the humble beginning that I grew up from. Mm -hmm. You know, I always wanted to, to be somebody who I can, I, I can think of, you know, later on down, I can sit, sit and look back at it and say, boy, this is good stuff. You know, this stuff will, will, will help a lot of people to, to, you know, especially from my country, Jamaica, because it's, it's an international show, so we can't just speak about just Jamaica, but the world itself, and people are in the same situation as we Jamaicans as well. Minutes from now. Minutes from now. The show, the first episode will be aired on CVM here. Yes, sir. How nervous are you? Very. Are you nervous? <laughs> <laughs> you I, I would be lying if I tell you I am not, because, yeah. like I said, I don't know, I've never seen most of the footage, they don't give me any, any heads up on nothing, what's going to go on. Okay. What, this camera thing kind of get me nervous because it follows me around. And, you know, here I am sometimes. I just get mad. Sometimes I'll just do something. And okay. they have all of that stuff. So I don't know what to expect now, you know. Mm. I don't know what my wife has said. You know, I don't know what the kids said. So the camera, I don't know, the everything. cameras, the cameras followed you around, they always, both of you. Yes. And everything was recorded. Everything. And the, the producers are now editing that and putting out something. That's, that's where I got nervous. Nervous right now. And they didn't they are saying the editing. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> We're just the producers. That's uh, all. How much does Ruby, uh, uh, <laughs> oh, how involved is your wife in the, in the editing and the producing? Not at all. None at all. So that she, was, too, is, that was she a too is very nervous. Right? Yes. That, that was a contract that we already had signed before that we are not supposed to be involved in no editorial, nothing. Oh. oh. So um, the producers and the exec and well, the executive producers, we're just here, but the yeah, producers yeah. themselves are doing a great job so far, as you've seen most of the footage. Yeah, um, we saw we saw preview. a little preview, a little yeah. snippet of it. Yes. So it was I'm compelling, I, I will say. <laughs> well done. It is being produced yes. by someone who's, who knows about TV, of Angela course. Thames. Yes, and Sanya Stroot as and, well. And Sanya. These and Dorian. Are, these are very good. Um, well accomplished producers. Oh, yeah. These are no try thing. This no, project is a top, a top a top project. Uh, absolutely. Um, one other thing I want to highlight is that we'll be also shown um, aired on um, on CVM on the twenty first, as you said before. Mm -hmm. Also, we're going to be in the tri-state area, New Jersey, New York, Connecticut, and also there's areas to be added next year, January. Okay. You know, as we, as you know, you all know. So the world should look up. Yes, and also Mastu will be carrying it globally, video on demand. Video on v VOD. Yeah. All yes. Right. So, all right, Melo. Looking thanks forward. for coming through and updating us. We'll keep oh, yeah. the rest of the argument well, till when the series <laughs> play out the commit. Yeah, I don't. We will go and watch it. Yeah, I will. I will see how you're from the TV. <laughs> <laughs> I we will listen for the phone call. I will be calling you. <laughs> yeah. I suspect I'll be calling you about stuff. But yeah, man, awesome. But it's interesting to see what unfolds in that series and how much we can learn from your own life, sir. Definitely. Congratulations on your marriage. Oh, thank you. And congrats on wanting to help others to better yes. their lives. Yes. So in a few minutes. Respect. The world will know, sir. Yes, sir. So good to have you. Oh, thank you. All right, Ninja Man fulfills promise to venture deep in the business of music. And a big question is, why was he hospitalized recently? We'll be here to answer that coming up right here on stage. And could we get him and Golly Pop, who is also coming up later, to sit together and bury the hatchet? On stage, I bet you, will be tried. So that's a lot to look forward to. But first, videos making our video stage after the break. And in that segment, the angel is moving from Hot Gal Army to Wine Factory. <laughs> wow, all coming up. We'll be back. Now the boat like no punk arm is still like a shawling moon. Hi, thanks for watching our video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking right here and enjoy so much more where that came from. You see, the older this wine gets, is the more it's, 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 
what do they call it? Fine. So it becomes a fine wine. It's no fine wine. Yeah, it's, 